first we got our tickets right over here. Then we saw this little board which welcomed us in. There was a little garden right in front of the palace which had numerous of statues in it. Like this one. It's quite long and there were two on each side which you can see now. There were a few statues which had human faces sculptured on it with the names on it like this one which has the name Dominton written on it. These are the pebbles that you can see while you walk. There was an arch right at the middle of the garden which had Edward's Seven Rex Imperator written on it. There were two women standing at the sides and a horse with a knight riding it on top. The grass here is quite fresh and the breeze is very cold. There are a lot of greenery that you can see and a few benches on which you can sit and enjoy the breeze. There was this lake that we found out, which was in the garden. And there was this huge nest that they've built. Look at how enormous it is. It's right beside the ark. This is the front view of the palace. Now let's walk towards it. Well, now we're closer enough to see it clearly. There's an angel that is blowing a trumpet, which is right on top of the palace. Right now we are actually searching for the entry because the front entry was blocked. This is the side view of the palace where you can see this huge garden at the back and this is the back view of the palace. There's a huge garden with a lot of trees there. This whole palace is made of marble. Imagine how many marble they would have needed. There were even a few birds that passed by us. We are still searching for the entry, but let's check out everything that we find out on our way. We took a few pictures at the spot before leaving. And here too. Look at how these green beds look. Alright, I guess it's time to check for the entry. This is what you can see from the back of the palace. There you can see a lot of marigolds and grass and bushes. This is where we finally entered the entry. There was this statue which had a lot of people in it. This looks like there was a uh, quite a big kind of celebration. Well now it's time to get our luggage checked before we enter. No. 
Now we are on our way to get ourselves checked, but before that we saw these statues. Even more statues at the entrance. Now well, let's get ourselves checked. Finally we got ourselves checked and entered the palace. Where you can see a lot of pictures, right? After you enter. And many more designs on the top. There were cameras everywhere. This seems to be Netaji's cap. There were a few metal blocks in the middle. There was a video playing at the center. Which had a lot of events presented. There are a lot of pictures that say a lot of words. How the leaders even controlled us while they were sick. There were a few letters that were stuck to the wall. This is a touch screen in which you can check a lot of images. Here I'm actually trying to get out of the picture. This one is one of the metal block. Um, right here we have a few badges and because of our enthusiasm, a few of the videos are taken at the wrong way. This was a fountain pen used by Netaji. This seems to be a dress from one of the people and this is a few of strands of the hair we took a few pictures at this spot then there were a lot of guns that were presented and even paintings look at how well that's painted Even though down here there were no AC, but it was quite cool because of the marble. These are a few pictures that we took nearby the huge paintings. And this is an original model that was presented. Here we are actually very excited about this area that we have took the video vertically. A few areas were restricted to enter, but still we took our best to take a few videos of them. This is the center of the hall, where there was a mirror block right at the center. This is a close look that you can see at the room. There were many more paintings that were presented. Right now we are figuring out the way to go on top as there were a few people standing there. But we found out a few more paintings and pictures on our way. This was the construction of the Victoria Memorial Hall. These are a few letters that were securely kept 
inside glass boxes. This is the place that we are figuring out to go on. We have returned to the entrance, still searching. Here's our glasses that are A few leaders are used, and the swords that were used in the wars. There were a lot of letters. Over here you can see outside from here. So it's quite interesting here. Right now we have asked the security guard how to go upstairs. And yeah, we found the way. But first, let's say goodbye to the ground. Here's also one way which is actually restricted. And this is the other way which everyone was going through. And we haven't seen this the whole time. Now finally we've come up. Look at how high this is. It's quite crowded right now. But still you can almost see the whole garden. few pictures that we took. Now all together. It's just so beautiful to see from here. Now we have gone to the other side where you can see the inner side of the palace.
Look at how many people are there. Well, now we are going to be taking on a few more female files. where we have to stand right in front of this screen where they would show that this is the fighter right inside me and this one's the fighter that's inside me well it was quite fun although it's not accurate We're going to have a little more fun up here. Well now we have returned to this place to look at everyone walking here and there. Look at how many people have come to visit this hall. There are a lot of designs in each and every roof. over the plants and the petals and everything. So we started wandering around the garden where we saw these sunflowers with a lot of bees on them. Cheryl. These sunflowers were so huge. This is the fountain that was present in the garden. And here we are, back at the lake. Oh well, it's a pond. <laughs> now you're just going to sit by near the pond. You can see us. We actually saw a few snails which were at the corner. 
which iron shell we're looking at. You can see a few buildings far away. And we are here back at the fountain where these sunflowers had a lot of bees on them. But we still tried to touch them. Look at how these sunflowers are. I wish I could get sprinkled by that fountain. Well, now this is the canteen that was present. This was the food there. And we are on the way to our exit. So we found this nest, which we saw earlier. Thank you.